With Caprisa recognized globally for its groundbreaking research on HIV and AIDS, such a partnership hardly comes as a surprise. Led by world-renowned South African AIDS researcher Professor Salim S. Abdul Karim, the center has received many accolades for its research findings. Sanusi, whose own interest is focused on a vaccine, says Caprisa's work has influenced HIV policies around the world. They were the first one to show that in certain conditions, using microbicide with antiretroviral drug, it could work. Uh, so, I mean, this is something very, very important, and that was the key to move on the use of antiretroviral drug as prevention. Caprice's scientific board meeting heard that there was a need to break the epidemic in the next five years to achieve the United Nations goal of ending the epidemic by 2030. South Africa is leading the world with new infections, a thousand a day, but also has the largest treatment program. The single biggest challenge in the HIV epidemic in South Africa is how do we prevent young women from getting HIV. The ability to change the epidemic in South Africa will be dependent on our ability to protect women from this virus. Science and Technology Minister Naledi Pando says 50 million rand will be made available to Caprisa over the next five years. Renee Heiner, SABC News, Durban.